to borrow a cup of sugar, I'd be happy to oblige. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, well, this is all a misunderstanding. My, my dog made a mistake. Wait, are you Charles Muntz? Yeah, well, uh, <coughs> yes. The Charles Muntz? Adventures out there. <laughs> it's really him. <laughs> That's Charles Muntz. It is? Who's Charles Muntz? Him. Yeah. Yeah. Carl Fredrickson. My wife and I, we were your biggest fans. Oh, oh well, you're a man of good taste. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now, you must be tired. Hungry? Uh-huh. Now, attention, everyone. These people are no longer intruders. They are our guests. Yeah! Well, I mean, I like you temporarily. You do smell like Chris. Oh, I will not bite you. A small mailman smells like chocolate. I'm sorry about the dogs. <laughs> Hope they weren't too uh, rough on you. We weren't. Go ahead and pour your airship uh, right next to mine. adventure itself. Oh, uh, would you like to? What a... <laughs> Wait up, Mr. Bunch. Shoot me quick. Not you. What do we do with Doug? He has lofty bird. Put him in the cone of shame. <laughs> Myself. Did you ever? Will you look at that? Oh, yes, the arson ethereal. Beast charged while I was brushing my teeth. Used my shaving kit to bring him down. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, surprise me. The only way to get it out of Ethiopia at the time was to have it declared as dental equipment. <laughs> oh, my gosh. The giant's so mighty and leopard tortoise. Oh, you recognize it. I, I'm impressed. That's an interesting story there. Excellent choice. <laughs> I uh, I found it on safari with uh, Roosevelt. He and I fell into a habit of playing gin rummy in the evenings. And did he cheat? Oh, he was horrible. <laughs> Master, dinner is ready. Oh, dear. Broken translator. Is that loose wire again? Yeah. There you go, big fella. Thank you, Master. I like this other voice. <laughs> Well, dinner is served. <laughs> right this way. So, how are things stateside? Huh? Almost tempted to go back a few times. <clears throat> but I have uh, unfinished work here. Please, uh, I hope you're hungry, because Epsilon is the finest chef I've ever had. <clears throat> oh, Epsilon, you've done it again. Yes. Ellie would have loved all this. You know, it's because of you. She had this dream to come down here and live by Paradise Falls. I'm honored. And now you've made it. <laughs> you sure were not a bother. I'd hate to impose. No, no, it's a pleasure to have guests. A real treat. Treat! Having guests is a delight. <laughs> <laughs> 